Hi. What's going on? Alright, listen, in this video I'm going to be talking about leaks for the state of play that's happening today. If you don't want to hear them, click off. Anyways, yeah, uh, mostly the Sonic Generations leak. Apparently we're getting a Sonic Generations remaster of some kind. Now, this is just a leak. It's not confirmed. Nothing is, uh, nothing is concrete. We know nothing. But let's talk about what this could mean. So for starters, it's very funny that every time something Sonic related happens, people are like, okay, now make a Sonic Unleashed PC port. And instead they're remastering Sonic Generations, a game that is already on PC. I honestly don't think it's necessarily a bad thing. I think a Generations remaster could be kind of cool. It's just funny that it's not unleashed. <laughs> now the main question is, how are they gonna fuck it up? Because we all know they're going to. It's gonna be fucked up. It's not gonna be good. I hate to break it to you guys. So what's gonna happen? Is it gonna be made by Blind Squirrel? That would be funny. Is it gonna be on the Switch or the next Nintendo console? Probably, actually. I doubt it will be on the Switch, but it, it might be on the next console. Actually, you know what? Knowing Sega, they might force them to make a Switch version. That's unfortunate. <laughs> the main question on my mind is why specifically Generations and why now? What made them want to remaster Sonic Generations over literally any other Sonic game? People have been wanting a Heroes remake or remaster. People would eat up an Adventure 1 or Adventure 2 remake or remaster. Hell, even Shadow the Hedgehog. Why Generations? Arguably the most complete Sonic game. Also, I wonder if anything will be different. Like, maybe they... Maybe if they know that Generations is a fan favorite, then they also know that Planet Wisp in this game sucks. Maybe they'll fix that. <laughs> Wouldn't it be really funny if they do a remaster of Generations? Everything is exactly the same. The graphics are exactly the same. The shitty PC performance is exactly the same. However, they add Boost Wisps back. <laughs> they, they remove your boost meter being filled up by rings. It's just Wisps. You know what would also be really funny? You know how Sonic Forces had episode Shadow, where it was just three very mediocre levels about what Shadow was doing before Infinite took over the world? Wouldn't it be hilarious if there is a single Shadow level? It's <laughs> Sonic Generations episode Shadow. It's just Shadow running through Green Hill, and then the time uh, guy whose name I can't remember attacks. <laughs> that's, the, that's, that's all of the added content. <laughs> Uh, I mean, and then there's, like, the obvious stuff. Give Classic Sonic a drop dash. I mean, hell, maybe even make Classic Sonic control more like the, um, Sonic Superstars version of Classic Sonic. I'd be down for that. I think Sonic controls really well in that game. Wait, what engine are they gonna use? Oh my god, wait, can you imagine a Generations remaster in the Forces engine? <laughs> oh, there are just so many ways that this can go wrong. It's, Generations is one of my favorite Sonic games. It was my favorite, but Frontiers has taken that spot. I am very curious what's gonna happen here. If it's good, I will be ecstatic. I am not expecting it to be good. I am expecting it to be made by Blind Squirrel. I'm expecting it to be an absolute mess. And a big one, I'm expecting it to completely ruin people's perception of Sonic Generations entirely. <laughs> oh, the days when people collectively agreed that Sonic Colors was good and Unleashed was bad. Oh, the days. It is still so impressive to me that Colors Ultimate single-handedly made everyone fucking hate Colors. No! <laughs> Not me, though. I still like Colors. Hell, I still like Colors Ultimate. And I played it on the Switch. To be fair, though, I like Unleashed, too. But... That's only the good parts of Unleashed. Its highs are higher than Generations, but its lows are so much lower. <laughs> if only I had a way to replay it. Sonic Unleashed Ultimate would go crazy. <laughs> Every time you press the attack button as the Werehog, the screen starts fucking glowing purple. I hope there's some sort of um, Sonic Generations 3DS representation in there. Because Generations 3DS is not as good as Colors DS. But I still think it would be cool. That was like my number one complaint with Colors Ultimate, is that it didn't even include the best version of Sonic Colors. 
They didn't have to do anything to it. Literally just throw the DS version in the package and it's great. There doesn't have to be a ton of stuff, just like one or two of the 3DS levels in the actual Sonic Colors, or Sonic Generations engine. Because Sonic Generations 3DS had completely different levels than the console version. Also, the boss fights were completely different. Um, fine. I can just keep all of Sonic Generations the same for the remaster, but the 3DS version of the Bio Lizard is just thrown in there. <laughs> Not as a boss fight, he's just like in the background of one of the levels. For those of you that don't know, I guess I should have said this um, before I started talking about a possible Generations remaster. Um, there's a Sony state of play today in a few hours, I believe, as of this going up. I might react to a Generations remaster announcement if that actually does happen. Something for Sonic Generations was leaked, basically. They could Mario Kart 8 us, where Mario Kart 8 came out in like 2013, 14, one of those is probably right. And then they made DLC for it in 2022, I think? Is that when the first wave of DLC came out? Probably. But like, what if they just do Generations DLC? That'd be pretty cool. I'd be okay with that. I'm starting over. You know what would be really epic? If it actually, you know, ran on the Steam Deck, as opposed to normal Sonic Generations, which runs like absolute dog shit on the Steam Deck. Now the real question is, when will it release? Man, you know, it's gonna sound crazy. I keep sounding crazy, but I'm really feeling September. I think, they know the Switch 2 is coming out in September. I feel it. I was talking to a friend and he was like, no, I think it's going to be October. No, 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 it's going to be September. I'm feeling it. Switch 2, September, it's happening. And Generations Remaster is coming out uh, the same day and it's going to be on Switch 2. And because they want to capitalize on Nintendo's consoles selling crazy. See, what all did Colors Ultimate even add? Because I assume they'd do something similar for a Generations remap. I guess it depends who makes it. Sonic Team is probably working on the next Frontiers style game. I think it's most likely Blind Squirrel. There isn't any important anniversaries coming up, right? They're not going to try and force it out, are they? Because I'm pretty sure Colors Ultimate was rushed out for the Sonic 30th anniversary thing to come out that year. But if there's nothing major happening for a while, maybe it will have the development time it needs? Might be a little hopeful of me to say that. Let's see, what are the worst case scenarios for this? What What is the worst way this can possibly go? I think probably a Sonic Generations remaster that is worse than the original and they delist the original. I think that is absolute worst case scenario. I'm trying to think what would even make sense for bonus content in this game. Like... Colors Ultimate had Racing Metal Sonic. I could maybe see them doing something like that again? Maybe not Metal Sonic though, since they already did that. Maybe like, uh, depending on what level you play, it's a different character. Like, if you do Green Hill, you race Tails. That's already a thing, though. I don't know why you would remaster Sonic Generations over literally any other Sonic game. Hell, remaster Forces. <laughs> that one probably needs it the most. I mean, here's the thing. It's not like they have a story to preserve, either. Like, with Colors, that game does technically have a story, as lighthearted as it is. So it's very hard to like completely overhaul some stuff and the most they can do is slip little elements in there of like Metal Sonic is there now, blah blah blah. But with this game, like the classic Sonic's already there, I don't know, fuck it, just throw Adventure Sonic in there just for the hell of it. <laughs> I mean, I don't know man. Every time I think about it, it sounds so hard to mess up. It sounds impossible to mess up. It sounds like the easiest thing on the planet, just take Sonic Generations, uh, up the resolution, up the textures, port it to every modern console. Boom. But they're gonna fuck it up. It, it, we said the same thing about Colors. Colors is a Wii game, and they fucked it up. I can only imagine what they're gonna do to an HD game. 
it just all depends on if it's Blind Squirrel, or it doesn't depend on if it's Blind Squirrel, because I feel like Blind Squirrel could make a good game if they are given time. But are they given time? It's Sega, they're not given time. <laughs> I just want it to be good. Sonic has been on such a hot streak lately. No. Anyways, yeah, Sonic has been doing so well recently. Frontiers was really good. He's had successful movies. Superstars was a mixed bag, but in my opinion, still pretty good. If we instantly go back to bad Sonic games right after we had Frontiers make us all excited for good Sonic games, that will be the worst bag fumble in video game history. <laughs> you know what? Maybe I'm thinking too simple. I saw the word Sonic and the word Generations. We don't technically know that it is the game Sonic Generations. Maybe it'll be like Generations DLC for Frontiers. Like it adds all the levels from Generations with the Frontiers engine and like they're well made or something. I don't know, man. I'm scared. <laughs> Please don't ruin one of the best Sonic games. Don't let the flame die out. All right, Mark, you know what? Regardless of how good it is, mark my words right now. If it comes out and it's bad, and people suddenly start talking about how they never liked Sonic Generations, I'm gonna be so pissed. And I'm gonna hold all of you motherfuckers accountable. You know, modern Sonic's levels and Generations were just worse versions of Sonic's levels and Unleash. They, they should make an Unleashed PC port. When are they gonna make an Unleashed PC port? I hate all of you. Shut up about an Unleashed PC port. It's not gonna happen. They don't like that game. You know what they need to do? Change classic Sonic's design. Like, make it the Superstars one. I know everyone talks like, it's, uh, Santiago, that's not Sonic, that's Santiago. Just, it, he looks so bad in this game. Please, for the love of all things holy. <laughs> that's pretty much everything I wanted to talk about with the Unleashed remaster leak rumor, yada yada. Or Generations. <laughs> you wish it was an Unleashed remaster. <laughs> uh, anyways, yeah, subscribe if you never want to see me talk about rumors ever again.